Fear, like a relentless predator, prowls at the edges of our lives, seeking to paralyze our dreams, suffocate our potential, and shroud us in darkness. It whispers doubts and insecurities, preying on our vulnerabilities, and hindering us from stepping into the abundant life God has designed for us. But here's the truth. Fear doesn't have to have the final say. We are not destined to be captives of our anxieties and worries. In the depths of our souls, there is a fire waiting to be kindled, a strength waiting to be unleashed, an unwavering resolve to stand strong in the Lord and overcome every fear that dares to challenge our faith. Are you ready to embark on a journey of liberation? A journey where fear is shattered, replaced by a steadfast trust in the one who holds the universe in his hands? Then buckle up. For within these words lies a roadmap to break the chains that bind you and to rise as a conqueror in the face of fear. Isaiah 41, 10. So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. This powerful scripture reminds us that God is with us and that we should not be afraid. He promises to strengthen and help us, holding us up with his righteous right hand. This verse assures us of God's unwavering presence and support as we face our fears and challenges. In the pages that follow, you will discover 10 powerful steps infused with timeless wisdom and divine truth. Each step is an invitation, a beckoning toward a life of courage, resilience, and unwavering faith. It begins with identifying and acknowledging your fears, those elusive adversaries that have haunted your steps for far too long. Then, through the power of prayer, you will learn to seek refuge in the comforting presence of the Lord, pouring out your fears and receiving His divine assurance. But this journey is not meant to be traveled alone. You will be encouraged to surround yourself with a supportive community of believers, for in unity lies strength. Together, you will lift each other up, intercede in prayer, and speak words of affirmation and truth that will propel you forward on this path to freedom. As you immerse yourself in the Word of God, His promises will infuse your being. Scriptures will come your battle cries, resonating deep within your soul, silencing the whispers of fear and replacing them with the resounding truth of His power and love. You will learn to focus on His promises, anchoring your thoughts and heart on His unwavering faithfulness. But this journey requires more than theory. It calls for action. You will be challenged to take small steps of faith, stepping outside your comfort zone and witnessing the miraculous unfolding of God's strength in your life. Through the empowering embrace of worship and gratitude, you will discover that fear cannot coexist with a heart overflowing with praise. This roadmap to victory will guide you through the valleys of forgiveness, self-care, and the wisdom glean from godly mentors. You will find solace in journaling God's faithfulness, documenting the moments where His hand was undeniably at work. And armed with the sword of Scripture, you will memorize and meditate on verses that will fortify your spirit, driving away fear with the power of God's Word. With each step, fear's grip will loosen and your faith will rise like a phoenix, radiating the light of God's love and truth. You will be equipped to serve others, to reach out with compassion, and to witness the transformative impact of bold acts of love. Dear friend, the time has come to shed the shackles of fear and embrace the fullness of life that God has ordained for you. As you embark on this journey of overcoming fear, and standing strong in the Lord. May your spirit be ignited, your heart be filled with courage, 
and your faith soared to new heights. The pages that follow are an invitation to a life of liberation, a life where fear is conquered and the abundant blessings of God's grace and power flow unimpeded. Joshua 1.9 Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. In this verse, God commands us to be strong and courageous, assuring us that He will be with us wherever we go. He encourages us not to be afraid or discouraged. This scripture emphasizes the importance of trusting in God's presence and promises, knowing that He is always with us, guiding and protecting us on our journey. Will you accept the invitation? The choice is yours. Let us embark together on this transformative voyage, unlocking freedom, seizing destiny, and emerging victorious on the other side. For far too long, fear has held you captive, casting a shadow over your dreams and ambitions. But deep within you, there is a spark, a divine spark that yearns to burst forth into a blazing flame of courage and strength. It's time to stoke that fire, to break free from the chains of fear and to walk in the fullness of God's purpose for your life. Within the words that follow, you will find 10 more indispensable keys to unlock the door to fearlessness and unshakable faith. These keys will empower you to step into the greatness that God has destined for you. They will challenge you to confront your fears head on, to gaze into their eyes with unwavering resolve, and to declare that you are a child of God, clothed in His strength and armed with His promises. As you journey through the remaining points, you will discover the transformative power of self-care, a holistic nourishment of your mind, body, and spirit. By taking care of yourself, you will cultivate resilience, fortitude, and a renewed sense of purpose. The power of forgiveness will also be unveiled as you learn to release the burdens of the past and embrace the freedom that forgiveness brings. By extending grace to others and yourself, you will dismantle the strongholds that fear has erected in your life. Open your heart and mind to the wisdom of godly mentors who have walked the path of faith before you. Their experiences, guidance and insights will serve as beacons of light illuminating your way and giving you the courage to press forward. And as you diligently memorize and meditate on Scripture, the Word of God will become a mighty weapon in your arsenal. It will be a sword that slices through the lies of fear and exposes them for what they truly are. Empty deceptions, the truth of God's Word will empower you to stand firm, to resist fear's relentless advances, and to proclaim victory in the name of Jesus. But this journey is not just about personal transformation. It's about serving others and making a difference in the world around you. By reaching out to those in need, by shining the light of Christ in the darkest corners, you will witness the miraculous power of love, compassion, and acts of service Fear will flee in the presence of genuine, selfless love. So, my friend, I implore you to take hold of these additional keys, to unlock the potential that lies dormant within you, and to step boldly into a future free from the chains of fear. Embrace the challenges, for they are opportunities for growth. Embrace the discomfort, for it is the birthplace of strength. Embrace the unknown, for it is where faith is tested and fortified. Together, let us press forward, hand in hand, as we navigate the terrain of fear and emerge on the other side, victorious and transformed. Let us declare, with unwavering conviction, that fear has no power over us. 
for we serve a God who is greater, stronger, and more faithful than anything we may face. Are you ready, my friend? The journey awaits, and the destination is a life marked by courage, purpose, and unwavering faith. Let us take these final steps together, unlocking the doors that have kept us bound and soaring to new heights in the power of the Lord.